We're gonna teach you about heart sounds. It's like a gifted child that turned out happy. <laughs> it's like the size of my head. Oh my god. Oh. What's up everyone, welcome back to the vlog. If you're new here, my name is Justin and I'm a first year medical student at the CWRU School of Medicine. Today is Monday and we had IQ. So as always, we had two patient cases. Uh, it's been a little bit since my last vlog. Uh, so we just ended up finishing cardio last week and we have renal this week. So the two patient cases were on that. So my goals for today are to finish my Anki and also start reading Costanzo to understand normal physiology. So it's about 10 o'clock now. I'm gonna try and work until about 11, 11.30, eat lunch and then head over to a coffee shop to study. So I'll see you guys there. All right, so lunch break, we have tofu sisig and some fried rice for my dad. We have Priyanka and Akil here. I heard you were the best scribe. Oh no, I was actually very not amazing. <laughs> Got, how's Reno going? It's going well. We just finished cardio. We're starting to piece things together. Hi, Rimsha. What's up, how was your day? Uh, <laughs> let me brag. Okay. I finished both IQ research. Whoa. So I woke up at 5 a.m. and then I watched B and B in the morning. You are crazy. I feel like I'm on another level right now. You're Apparently. superior to all of us. By myself, all alone by myself. All right, guys. We are at our favorite coffee shop in Cleveland. Shout out to Leco Coffee. Um, I have a director's meeting for Doc Opera, but not too busy the day after that. Just gonna grind out some IQ research, um, and I'll see you guys in there. All right guys, we just finished up at the coffee shop. Had a pretty productive day. I got my IQ research done for the first case. Did all of my Anki, unlocked a bunch of new cards. But now we are about to head over to the gym for a nice workout. My legs are super sore from running recently, but can't do anything about that. Hopefully squats don't hurt too much, but I will see you guys there. All right guys, we just got home from the gym, had a great workout. We are about to eat dinner. I have some waffle fries. I have a Morningstar steakhouse style burger and a singular bun. And then I have to mop while this cooks up because I have been kind of procrastinating and cleaning around the house. So I'm gonna eat dinner and then we're gonna watch a show to end the night. I have been recommended to watch Three Body Problem, I think it's called on Netflix. So very excited for that, and I will see you guys there. Bone apple tea, dinner is served. Not my best work, but I made dinner very quickly, and it's like nine o'clock. Plus we got some protein in there. Um, also happy holy to those who celebrate. Uh, I had a little holy celebration with some friends. Um, shout out to Shivangi and her parents for hosting. I'll put like a picture right here or something, but very fun. Um, now I'm gonna eat dinner, take a shower, wind down for the night. Uh, we have a pretty busy day tomorrow. I'm leading Tuesday seminar and we also have Garla. So I'll see you guys there.
All right, so we just finished Tuesday's seminar, which was on uh, patient adherence and creating treatment plans with them. A lot of great discussion on what we can do as future physicians in working with the patient to create a treatment plan that they'll adhere to. But now we're on the way to Garla. Have radiology first, and we'll see you guys there. So right here, we have a normal aorta. You see it's very hyper dense, but it's pretty uniform. Um, but in this aorta, we have a false lumen right here. It's called an aortic dissection, and it's very abnormal. <laughs> Hi, Rishi. Hi. How was Garla? It was good. It was quite easy today. Yeah, I thought so yeah. too. Okay, vlog. We are working on our garden right now. We're on top of it. We're going to teach you about heart sounds. So you can hear when you put your little stethoscope on. And I'm Shibni's behind the camera. I'm listening to Shibni's heart. The, the yeah. first thing I'm going to hear is the love of the love dub. That's going to be your S1 heart sound. The S1 heart sound is the closure of your mitral and your tricuspid valves. Um, those happen basically at the same time. But for your S2 heart sound, which is the dub of your love dub, you're gonna hear your aortic and your pulmonic valves closing. And the thing about that is the aortic valve, so A2, is gonna close before P2. And that's because there are higher pressures in your systemic system that close it faster. Um, but there are some certain pathologies that can cause splitting of your A2 and your P2. So for example, if you have something that delays your pulmonic valve closing, like deep inspiration, you're gonna lower your uh, pressures in your thoracic cavity, right? Okay, excuse me, give me, a, give me a thumbs up. You're gonna lower the pressures of your uh, thoracic cavity, increase your preload because there's more filling, and that increased filling is going to increase the preload of your right heart and cause it to, cause P2 to happen later. So now instead of your A2 happening here, and your P2 happening here, your P2 would happen later on. This is probably reversed on the camera, but. P2, P2 A2, 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 P2. P2. Deep inspiration, increased preload later. Yeah. All right guys, mid-study session, I got an email that my proposal has been accepted by the Case Medical Student Summer Research Program. So, we are gonna get paid for research instead of doing it for free. Very happy about that. Very happy. <laughs> Try saying glomerular sclerosis three times fast. <laughs> Okay, shouldn't it go? Glomerular <laughs> Lolo. <laughs> Alright guys, it's about 3 o'clock now. We spent the whole day basically studying anatomy, which is fine, but I'm going to try and switch gears and brush up on some of the antirhythmic drugs that we've learned about um, and finish out some of my Anki. Uh, we have about two hours to do so because at five we have a Horizons event about sports medicine and then afterwards we're going to hit the gym and end the night with some Shogun. So, pretty busy day, but I'll see you guys there. My fearless Horizons leaders, yes. how was it? It was great. I thought it went well. I think it could have been a little more organized, but I think it went well. Yeah. I think yeah. it was cool. Scott? We had so much food. <laughs> they couldn't find my gallbladder for like 30 minutes. And oh, wow. even the ultrasound tech couldn't find it. So it's my theory is someone stole it while I was sleeping. <laughs> yeah. Um, but I also got to ultrasound on myself. While I was laying down, I found the um, sub-xiphoid view through the liver. So I'm pretty proud of myself. Did you find your gallbladder? Also, I was supposed to work out with a kill at seven. It is now seven. He forgot that he had a meeting till eight. So now I have to stay here for an hour. My boy is ready to dive in. <laughs> hey, what are you? <laughs>
Yeah, okay, this is a beautiful donut. Yeah. Donut it's like the size of my <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Angie, you're back. You're I'm returned. Back. How was IQ? IQ was great. It was it was shorter than usual. We ended 10 minutes early. 10 minutes early? Yeah. We ended 20 minutes early. Not we, but how, how early did you end? We did. <laughs> glomerulus, glomerulus, glomerulus. That's my that's my goal for IQ. It's just to practice pronouncing glomerulus. Wait, don't don't you have a a twin? Yeah, a kill. A kill. Is he wearing it? My brother. How was IQ? Um, people were thankful I didn't speak as much. <laughs> Ayush, but no beanie. I know. I'm wearing a hat still, and I feel like I wore this shirt last time you recorded too. I think you did. You only own one shirt. Guys, you can't. No, 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 no. <laughs> Welcome back to Block 4 Fun Fact of the Day. Okay. First off, we have Ayush. My fun fact is that when you do a kidney donation, like kidney donors, they take your left kidney because the left renal vein is longer. And also fun fact is that... I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> Shvangi? Your heart at rest, a healthy heart, will pump five liters of blood a minute. That's crazy. That is crazy. And it's going to be even more when you're exercising like 20, 30. A minute. Home. Wild. Fun fact of the day. Um, some people have a retained connection between their umbilicus uh -huh. and the dome of the bladder, so the top of the bladder. Mm -hmm. And in pa babies who have that, you might see urine come out of the umbilicus. I don't know anything right now. <laughs> Okay, bye everybody. Can you give us a sneak peek on what the Doc Opera theme might be? No, I can't do that. Okay, fine. Top secret. Alright guys, so it was a long and painful day of studying followed by a long and painful run. We ended up doing about 13.1 miles, so a half marathon. And the only thing enjoyable about it was the Dune audiobook, which I highly recommend. I was planning on doing 14 miles, but I realized while I was running that I was gonna be super late to my Block 3 reunion, uh, Block 3 IQ reunion dinner. So if you're in my Block 3 IQ group, I am so sorry that I'm late. I realized like 10 miles into this run that I was running too slow to make it on time. And despite my best efforts, I could not speed up enough. I couldn't speed up enough to make up for that. So we are like two minutes away from dinner and I will see you guys there. Also a quick update. Thank you to those who recommended uh, foam rolling uh, for my knee pain. No more pain and my runs are a little bit more enjoyable now. Oh, I just swallowed on the wrong. <laughs> All right, so we just finished up with my reunion dinner with my Black 3 IQ group. Super fun, I love that group, so I was really happy that we were able to catch up. But now we're headed home because we have our first IM softball game. So I'm gonna change real quick and then head over to the field. But I am really bad at baseball, so I'm guessing I'm really bad at softball. And my legs are basically dead, so we'll see how it goes, but I'll see you guys there. Oh, really? <laughs> oh. No! Let's go, Jay. Oh, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad. That's good. That's good contact, that's good contact. I think we're aiming at this point, Ryan. Oh. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Good morning, guys. It is Thursday, and if you've watched my vlogs before, you've probably noticed that Thursdays are very, very free for me. Um, and this Thursday is much more of the same. So we don't have any required like classes today So I'm gonna head out to a coffee shop because right now it's like 9 30 and I've been awake since 9 o'clock And have not done a single thing at home So I gotta get out of the house get some work done and then at 4 p.m. We have a culinary lab with the wellness pathway. I'm super excited about that It's been a while since we've been in the teaching kitchen. So I think it's about I'm not gonna lie. I can't remember which uh, or what the topic is for today's session, but we're gonna make some good food, get a free dinner, um, but we're gonna head over to the coffee shop right now and I'll see you guys there. All right, so I just checked, and today's topic for the culinary lab is successful aging. So probably foods that promote the longevity that everyone's looking for nowadays.
Hi, Hello, I'm Rishabhan is tired and irritable. Hi, Shivni. Shivni is also awesome. Shivni's happy and stuff. <laughs> Hello, Suwan. How was Garla today? Hi, Garla was great today. So good that you wanted me to quiz you on things. I, <laughs> I kind of like that. Time. Okay. And then I came here for this guy. Which one was the best? Living Anatomy, Radiology, yeah, living or anatomy. Living Anatomy? I had a woman with really short hair who was a really good teacher today. Nice. Yeah. Are you recording? Uh huh. <laughs> this is proof that I get bullied at CWR. <laughs> <laughs> so drippy. <laughs> okay, so we just left the coffee shop, and unfortunately, most of my goals were not accomplished this afternoon. But that's fine. I ended up finishing most of my IQ research, but the SEQ was untouched, and no Pathoma videos were watched. So it's kind of the theme of med school where you're just kind of perpetually behind, but that's okay. Now we're headed over to the teaching kitchen for our culinary session. Very excited about it, and then we'll hit a workout afterwards. So I'll see you guys over there. So Andrew and I have picked the roasted butternut squash soup. We gotta get started because this butternut squash must roast for 60 minutes. So, step one. What's up? Something, something to it though. It's like a gifted child that turned out happy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I hope this batch is better than the one we tasted. It actually does taste In all fairness. What do you think? I think it needs a little bit more salt. Salt? We should go get some more salt. Okay, wait, let me try. I think it needs some salt and pepper. And pepper. Okay. Salt and pepper? All right, let's do it. This is my <laughs> my desk. This is a great um, mirror. This is my mirror. This is a view of the hospitals because you know you have to like um, so look at your goals. UH. Yep. And yeah, this is a painting that my mom made. Beautiful. Original piece. Your mom is very multi-talented. Yes. Um, can you see the clinic from here or no? Yeah, clinic is that side. Okay, so you can see the clinic. Wow, we're just surrounded by hospitals. Also. Um, give us your favorite book on this bookshelf. So actually my favorite book is on this Oh, book. okay, okay. <laughs> Come this way. Those are the books that I don't like as much. <laughs> um, hmm. It's hmm. a lot of pressure. Hmm, I know, I'm kind of nervous. I like this book a lot, Cloud Cuckoo Land. Cloud Cuckoo Land. Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> Hi, Meha, um, otherwise known as Vernon. How was IQ? I always 
have a hard time in the morning. <laughs> no, IQ is good. We're learning about the kidney. Um, just kind of like basic info about renal transporters and hormones. I personally am very confused by this topic and having a bad time. Nodding, yes. But other people seem to have had a nice time today, so that was them. Okay, not that your topic isn't important, but more importantly, how excited are you for the murder mystery party tonight? I'm excited, but I'm super nervous. You are going to be the game master. I've literally never hosted a murder mystery And before. there's going to be like 32 people there. I don't even know the plot of the story. I don't know who dies. I yes. don't know anything. And you it's know in who like dies? And <laughs> <laughs> uh, this, the reason I called Meha Vernon is because that is I her character's an name. I am man named Vernon from Florida. Yes. But before, before we go to the murder mystery party, we're actually going to... A festival of colors uh, hosted by SAMHSA. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to have Lessie and Samosa. It's going to be at Edgewater Beach. It's going to be at Edgewater Beach. The weather is going to cooperate. Uh, totally will. It's <laughs> so beautiful and sunny out today. Um, and it's going to be a great time. Oh my god, you're bringing this, right? Yes. Okay, yes. Well, yes! We got the Festival of Colors, aka event which shall not be named. <laughs> we have murder mystery, but most importantly, we got the gym. Yeah. Performance goes to Justin! Alright guys, as I was editing the video, I realized I never ended the vlog. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Uh, majority of you guys who watch these videos are not subscribed. So please, please, please subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one.